you know, one question that customers ask is, Lucas, how do I manage 10,000 beacons, 100,000 beacons, hundreds of thousand beacons, right? Because that's the scale that our customers are looking for. We're building it for the folks who have a ton of IoT devices. They have a ton of different stakeholders needing that for different use cases, but they need a common platform and a common dashboard to do all this. This has included being able to use multiple devices with multiple outcomes. When we brought IoT services to life, we wanted to build something that leapfrogged what existed, that leapfrogged the competition. The history behind KLA, it is 90 years old now, and they started with the hi-fi. They developed a lot of technology and sound systems and microphones, and now we're moving to the Wi-Fi. So there is the say that KLA moved from the hi-fi to the Wi-Fi. In order to stay within that pane of glass and the ability to implement those uh, different applications within one platform is critical. Cisco DNA Spaces Indoor IoT Service is the industry first IoT as a service platform that works with our Wi-Fi 6 APs to deliver IoT outcomes at scale. We also have a massive partner ecosystem which enables our partners with app development teams to use the devices in the IoT device marketplace for their outcomes and use cases. And we've done this through a very robust streaming Firehose API that delivers all that data back to the application. By moving into DNA spaces and DNA connector, it takes less time and less engineering hours. It's like making a sculpture. You have that raw material, but you need those developers and software engineers in order to get the right APIs from the system in order to put it in a way that it's presentable to uh, develop those use cases. With DNA Spaces, yeah, you have the ability to manage the platform from your phone. You can create zones for these devices where they are within that network and you create alerts based on that. In previous deployment, the accuracy is like nine meter, but now we're getting into asset accuracy of one to five meters, which is great from technological perspective. One thing we're very, very excited about is the fact that we're creating a platform where everybody can play. We're trying to make everybody more successful. And part of this is trying to enable a platform for innovation around IoT. The most important thing that I will share with my colleagues is the simplicity in configuring and integrating different technologies with DNA spaces. I feel optimistic to implement this technology with more customers in the future because this is uh, the future.